Hi guys, so I'm back with another weekend away vlog. This weekend, well, kind of two days, um, I am off to Poole, which is basically next to Bournemouth. Um, I think we're going to go to Bournemouth for one day and then the other day uh, look around Poole and go to Dodledor. We did have like other things planned, like we wanted to go go to, I think it's Lulworth Castle, which is in... I think it's in Poole, I think. Um, it's around the area, but it is closed because the it is a bank holiday weekend, but the bank holiday is the Thursday and the Friday because of the Queen's Jubilee. Um, the castle's actually closed on Thursdays. No, it's not. It's closed on Fridays and Saturdays, but it's closed on Thursday, I think, because of the bank holiday. So we can't go and explore the castle. So that's one thing that we want to do, which we can't. Um, so we are looking for things to do. Um, we have like we've been to Bournemouth before, and I'm really not sure what to pack because every time I've gone to Bournemouth, it seems to be raining and the weather is really unpredictable. So um, I've literally packed like loads of outfits, different choices in case it rains because I really don't know what it's going to do. I mean, it looks really nice and sunny outside at the moment, and it feels really hot like through the glass. Um, I just hope it's nice and sunny down there, but we will have to see. So it's going to take about maybe just over two hours from where I am to get to Bournemouth. Um, it might take a bit longer because there might be a lot of traffic due to the bank holiday weekend. Everyone's probably got the same idea of going away um, and the weather's nice. Um, but the weather has been really up and down this week where I am and it's been raining and then next minute it's really sunny so yeah we just have to see how the weather goes and yeah play it by ear so i have done my packing um but i have got this case i've got those two bags there that white bag primark bag is full of like shoes because you know that's my outfit choices and i don't know what the weather's going to be so i've got different shoes that's like my day bag in case I want to change my outfit obviously my suitcase and then I've got my handbag so I have you know I take lots of things um yeah this is my outfit at the moment it's just a dress ignore the slippers I've got my Powerpuff Girl slippers on um but yeah that's my dress at the moment I think I might wear some tights with it um because I think it might be cold to begin with or I might change my outfit completely I'm not really sure yet um yeah I have no idea. So we're about half hour into our journey and we've already hit some traffic, but I did forget that we're actually going past Gatwick and Heathrow Airport. So yeah, it's very busy. Prepare to Lot of traffic. Right soon and continue to follow the M25 towards yeah. Birmingham. Don't know how long it's going to take. It's saying we should get there at, what is it? That's the time now. Oh, it was on there. It says 11 something. So I think we've maybe got another two hours. So yeah, yeah. 40 miles to Bournemouth. I think it's taken us about an hour and a half to get to here. <laughs> but we hit more traffic. And while I was in my car, I noticed that my shoe <laughs> is broken. So we need to go to the shops and get some more because I'm not walking around like that. So yeah. And I didn't bring any more sandals. Look at all that traffic. <laughs> Look at all that traffic. So we just made it, just parked up, and it actually took us four hours to get here today. <laughs> Instead of the two normal hours, it actually took us four hours. Yep. It's quarter past one. Um, so I think we're going to find some lunch, maybe. Yeah. Um, I'm always hungry, you know me. Yeah. And I made the right decision to wear a dress, because it is hot. So we've actually got good weather for once in Bournemouth. Normally it's raining, so yeah. good weather. We've been here, what, two, three times? It's always, always yeah. raining. <laughs> It's very busy. Do you want to hold your shoes No, I'm right, thanks. Cliffs over there, they're called the polar bear cliffs or something, I don't know. It's the shape of a polar bear. 
not. But Rachel can't see it. It's definitely, I'm going to put a picture in. And you're going to see the picture and you'll be like, oh yeah. Yeah, but it's probably a picture taken out of the sea. <laughs> Primark to find some sandals. We're in the hunt. So we just left Bournemouth. Um, I didn't find any shoes. Shop ship wasn't that successful. So now we're going to go to. Well, we're going to go check into the hotel and then probably go to Pool Shopping Centre and find some shoes. Uh, we did sit on the beach for a little bit. That was nice. And then um, we end up getting McDonald's fries for lunch, but that was it. I think it was like quarter past two by the time we ate. Yeah, it was half like that. Half two. And also we want to eat dinner later, so we just thought we'd get something small. So yeah, we're on the way to hotel and then go to the pool shopping centre. What else did we have? Steph got to mention we also I had a McFly ice cream and Steph had a cooking or McDonald's as well. So we didn't just have fries. Just 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 so you know. So Steph had a cooking and I had a I think it was a flake McFlurry. Woo! It was very nice. <laughs> very, very nice. So we just checked into the hotel room and this is our room. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Chat <laughs> off the camera. It's a little place. We've got our luggage in the bathroom. We've got a shower. There's a toilet and a sink. And yeah, I think it's like the bed's smaller than what we're used to because we normally send the Premier in. But it will do for two nights. And then we've got our beautiful view. There is a boat in Lake uh, somewhere, but obviously we didn't get that view. Of course not. But yeah, that's our little snack table. Yeah, so that's... We're at, well, I didn't even say where we are. We're at the Holiday Inn in Pool, uh, next to the shopping centre. So we are. Which we're going to next. Yeah, which we're going to, which is literally just over the road. But I think... Probably still got to drive there. So yeah, go to shopping centre and then try and find some shoes and then I don't know what we're doing for dinner. Yeah, find out what we're doing for dinner. We need to find some places. I think there's a nice place near the harbour. Yeah, harbour. Cool harbour. I think it's literally... Actually, no, I don't think it's like a... Just drive there. I don't think it's like a half, half hour walk. Oh, so I'm going to have to drive there. Um, but yeah. Go to work off dinner or for a half hour walk if you wanted. Sure. We can <laughs> sure. go and explore. We, no. we can go and see the scenery. We can go. Exactly. I just need to maybe change my shoes into trainers, maybe. So we've driven to the shopping centre and we're here. It took us one second to drive. <laughs> we should have walked. <laughs> we could have walked, but um, I thought it was further, but it's really not. It's literally the hotel's literally right behind us. Yep. But never mind. We'll walk to the pool harbour. To make up for it. <laughs> yeah. We don't know where we're going. We don't know where we're going. Yeah. Sure. Trying to find the shops. Oh, Richard found it. Just go forward. Just go forward. Just go. Found it. I finally got my shoes and another pair of shoes. So I got two shoes and we got a nice Starbucks. I got pink coconut refresher. What'd you get? Caramel frappuccino, cream bake with whipped cream on top. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> got our dinner. So we've got our dinner. We went for a Taco Bell. And then we both got the was it Volcano. I don't know what it's called. Meal deal. So we've got burrito. Meal deal. And I got the one with beef. I've just got beef and rice. I took all the cheese out of it. You got chicken. Chicken with everything in it, I think. And then we got a taco as well with beef, lettuce and mine. Rich's got cheese and that. Got the fries and it also came with churros as well. And a drink. So yeah, that's our meal. Because we were booked so... Um, we didn't book anything to eat, so we were a bit late. Everything's booked up, so we... 
got a takeaway. Well, we've booked tomorrow though. Yeah. Because we're clever. Yeah. <laughs> Try and get ahead of the game. <laughs> we're at Hawkey. We decided to drive instead of walk. Yeah, it's a bit of ass. <laughs> Sat the navigation wasn't working, so drive on the bike. It's going to be fun because I don't like boats. <laughs> <laughs> So we finished our walk at the quay. My hair is absolutely mess. It's your hair mess? Yeah, it's not too bad. <laughs> yeah, right. And now we're gonna have a cup of tea and some snacks. And the only thing I like about this hotel room is this chair. <laughs> this stinky chair. I'm just really biting the room. <laughs> but yeah, I think we're gonna go back to the quay tomorrow. Yeah, gym bite in the morning. Yeah, because there was like stalls and stuff and I think we missed it, they were all closing up. Yeah. Um, so we're going to go back tomorrow and then after lunch we're going to go to Dirtle Door. Yeah. Because we went there before, but I didn't actually see it because we walked to the top and then we thought it was in the wrong place so we walked back down again. No, I'm, we were there but it was a little, I'm pretty sure we went up to the, we made it to the top but we were so out of breath and we saw how far we <laughs> had to go we were like, oh sod that, no way. Yeah, but I didn't see it. I saw it, you could see well, it. I didn't see it. Oh, well. <laughs> Morning. Morning. Just going down for breakfast now. I think we decided we're going to go to Paul Carver yeah. instead of the key. Facing that sound right, so it would be really nice. I'm having breakfast at 6 I feel like I always have the same breakfast. Yeah, they. So, breakfast was a bit of a disappointment. There wasn't really much there. There was literally the hot stuff. There was hot stuff was beans, scrambled egg, scrambled egg, bacon, and sausage. sausage. That was it. There was croissant, toast, bread. There was apple, banana, yogurt, cereal. That was really it for breakfast. Yogurts, fruits. Oh, and uh, the, you had uh, apple juice or orange, orange juice. juice. Anything if you had tea, I had apple juice, and it was like water. <laughs> Yeah, and I didn't really eat much. I only had Cocoa Pops, croissant, and a little chocolate muffin. Um, but then, oh, it's my fault. I don't eat meat, so that's partly my fault. And then, I can't have dairy, so that's not my fault. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm limited to what I could have. But normally, at the other holiday inns, you get loads of breakfast. Like, they do pancakes, don't they? Yeah, they have a pancake. And they have too. so... And, and the other holiday inns we stayed in before, in Brighton, they had vegan sausages. Um, so there was not a lot for breakfast, so we're probably going to go out and get something else to eat. <laughs> yeah, it's looking likely, I think. And also, there's not a booking system where you give a time, you literally just show up and you sit down. So if there's no tables left, you literally, you got to wait. So, yeah. Well, they did give us the warning of avoid nine o'clock, so at least they gave us that warning, but that's about it. But it still got really busy, didn't yeah. it? Right, but we went down at eight, so that was an hour before, so God mm. knows what it's like when it's busy, Jesus. Yeah, so not great breakfast. So we're on our way to Sandbanks. We're not going to Pool Harbour because I think Pool Harbour is the same thing as Pool Key. Pool Key? Yeah, <laughs> Don't sound quarry. right. Well, I, I keep calling it a quarry, so. Quarry. <laughs> <laughs> Which is um, definitely not a quarry. <laughs> so yeah, we're going to go Sandbanks, have a little look, as it's supposed to be really nice there. And they've got a little crazy golf, so we're going to probably play crazy golf because we always do, don't we, when we go. Yeah. Seasides. Big 
fish. Can't see it in the video. But right, there's two crabs. Oh yeah, there it is. There's crab. Or the two crabs. Oh yes, yeah, two crabs, they're fighting. There's a dog paddle boarding. It's so cute. in the morning and it's already busy gonna be a busy day today all right Richard thinks these are slides so he's gonna try and go down one <laughs> not very comfortable are these slides? <laughs> so the crazy golf wasn't open, but I think we're going to check back in. I'll see if we're muffin. Yeah. Sit on the beach for a bit. Enjoy the weather. Yeah. Mm. A bit cloudy, but I'm sure it'll pop out again soon. Golf is open, but it's very busy. I'm gonna win. No, you're not. <laughs> you know how competitive I get. Yeah. Can't There's always it. like one point between us, though. I just got a hole in one on this one. Goes up there, up there, and over here. <laughs> Woo, I got a hole in one, but I didn't film it. Woo! Keep where we were. Half of my shots, that's a joke.
53. On the last hole, Richard got one, I got seven. The one before that, or two before that, Richard got 13, I got seven. So, what are the scores? So 40, 53. Yeah, you got 63. So I got, I thought you said 61. Yeah, it might be 61, yeah. I got 61 and Richard got 50. 58. 58. Rich 58, Steph 61? Yeah, something like that. So Rich one. We'll put that, we'll, 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 post, we'll post this just so you can see it. Just in case my maths is really, really wrong. It's probably bad. So they are the scores. 16, we had a, I had a shocker. 30, look at that. Yeah. So we just got back to the hotel, quick freshen up, change my shoes. This one I got from Primate yesterday, but um, I've got loads of plasters on the back of my feet already. <laughs> So yeah, change into trainers so we can walk up to see Dirtle Door, have some lunch on our little table. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. And then we're gonna drive to Dirtle Door. Go walk up the hill. Go Dirtle Door. Go see if we can find it actually. Oh, it's just there. I must be in the island. Not Brown Sea Island. Yeah, we've got to walk up the hill. We're training for <laughs> when we climb um, Snowden. Yeah. <laughs> We're training. So we found an easy way to come up. Last time we went up the really difficult way. Yeah. But we actually parked in the Dirtle Door car park this time. So that's down there, that's where we parked last time. And we kind of the really big hill. So we parked in that car park and we walked all the way up there last time. And it was hot, wasn't it? So to get down, we've just climbed down all of that instead of the stairs. <laughs> but we made it. Definitely practicing for the mountain. How was that walk? I thought it was alright. A bit like I said, a bit like scaffolding. Yeah, kind of like the stairs is like scaffolding. Um, now we're about to climb up. It's just busy. Walk I mean, up a hill. Yeah, we're about to walk back, but it's just busy, like. Very I'm trying, busy. I'm trying to stay on the left, but I've got people over the table. It's just stupid. Yeah. It is what it is. Yeah. Yeah. 
less time when you go up down as well. Your oh no, we took half hour to get down to the actual beach of Jurassic. I was going to say Jurassic Park then, Jurassic Coast. <laughs> There's the door. Yeah, and then it's taken us eight minutes to get back up from, I've done yeah. it from the top. Yeah. So I see you coming up. I was pretty busy going down to be fair as well. Yeah, my heart rate's 170. Ooh. Good work out of that. Look at the queue to get in now to the car park. We came at the right time. <laughs> that we is definitely did. ridiculous. We definitely did, I like it. But we're gonna go to the other village. Yeah, we're gonna go to the other little village now, the other car park, and we're gonna get a... Ice cream! <laughs> oh, before Steph's case, a sorbet. A sorbet, yeah. Let's find something nice. Your destination on the left. And uh, a drink, because, yeah, after that walk, I'm a bit thirsty. I mean, your heart rate ran up to 108. I'm not surprised, you know what I mean? Yeah. So just parked up, come to get an ice cream and now it's starting to rain. Of course. <laughs> it's coming down heavy. <laughs> Sorry, Not really. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> oh my gosh. I need my walking boots. <laughs> you just need to watch where you're going. <laughs> Creams. I, got, I end up with my uh, my vanilla <laughs> ice cream because I didn't have any sorbet, so that's what's left. Yeah. And then what did you get? So I got sour caramel on top and then underneath um, cookie dough. And a flake. And a flake on top. But I did ask for a cookie dough and chocolate heaven, but then I didn't have any chocolate heaven, so I was like, oh, whatever, sour caramel will do. You know. It's pretty nice to be fair. I think everyone's getting ice cream. Ice cream queues are pretty busy everywhere, so yeah. they're all running out. And as you see in the video, I did fall over. <laughs> and I did hurt my ankle a little bit. <laughs> it is hurt a little bit, but it's not that bad. It's okay. <laughs> so funny. Okay, so we're just on our way to uh, get dinner. We eating at J Just Ask? No, Ask. ask J Italian. Just Ask. <laughs> just Ask. <laughs> ask Italian um, in Bournemouth. <laughs> Absolutely. Because I, I had just eaten in my head. Um, ask Italian. Uh, in Bournemouth, so we're gonna eat dinner there and then probably go back to the hotel and then order pudding and <laughs> get um, this, well, like the waffle and like warm waffle for ice cream and stuff. Don't worry, you'll see the video of it, so yeah. you'll, be, you'll be fine because yeah. they found, I think, a more vegan one. We were gonna go Casper's, but Casper's don't really do vegan, I don't think, or as much vegan as what Steph found. So, whatever Steph found, we'll just go with. Yeah. I'm sure you, look, you guys will see what, what, whatever we order. And they do cookie dough. You know that cookie dough made in blue water? Oh, the vegan Stuff. one? Well, I don't know if it's vegan, but... <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh, but yeah, go to Ask Italian. And then, yeah, after um, we had ice cream, we just went back to the hotel. Had a shower. Because um, after climbing up all those... What do you call them? Hills? Yeah. I don't know. The um, they, it was very like chalky, like dusty from all the loose stones, rocks, whatever you want to call them. Uh, so yeah, we just had a shower and... Gosh. What, yeah. you're in the wrong lane? Yeah, I'm in the wrong lane. Um, so. Uh-oh. Yeah, go and have some dinner. It's just to ask Italian. Ask Italian? Yeah. And we've got free lemonade. I'm going to try it. Chin chin. Nice. Got a nice flag for the Jubilee. It's funny. Speak with your mouth full. Do as Italians do and let your hands do the talking. Excelente. <laughs> I don't know that one. So. <laughs> I've got my spaghetti bolognese and my drink. Strawberry mojito. And you got pizza with loads of stuff on top. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Back at Bournemouth on the pier, and Richard can now see the polar bear cliff. We were, it was the, I told you before, it was the angle. We were all the way over there, now I can see the polar bear. Yeah. It's 
So we just finished our Ask Italian and we decided to go and get pudding from Miller and, and Carter. Carter. And then Steph pointed out, um, we're at a seaside resort. Um, why don't we just get donuts? So, um, yeah. yeah, we've already paid for our pudding, so instead of going back to the hotel and ordering it, we thought we'd get it from Miller and Carter, but then we found out we have to eat it in the car because it comes with ice cream. <laughs> so we can't go back to the hotel because it's 20 minutes away. <laughs> Yeah, so we're just going to order it, inhale it, and go back to the hotel. Yeah. <laughs> back to the hotel with our puddings. Mm. Pud puddings. Yeah. So I've got my, I can't remember what it's called. It's called like a, I think it's a Biscoff tort thing. Strawberries. Can't even open it. That's mine. And then Rich has got... A sticky toffee pudding. My if I can open it. My sticky toffee pudding. But it didn't come with ice cream. But even if it did come with ice cream, because we were going to eat it in the car. Yeah, we were going to eat them in the car, but then it didn't come with spoons. So um, we had to wait until we got to the hotel. And then we come up with a plan and we can use our um, the spoons we get with tea and coffee. Because that's the only spoons we got. We we got nothing. So we're going to have to use them. Um, to eat our puddings because we don't they didn't give us any so get your pudding and have a tea so we just finished our pudding it's very nice and um, so we're gonna pack mm. our stuff up because we're leaving tomorrow and we're leaving early because one because Rich is playing cricket yeah cricket <laughs> we love cricket um, and also because it's the bank holiday weekend and I think people are going to be travelling the way we're going because people are going to be going to London to visit the Queen. So we're going to leave early to try and avoid traffic. But it did take four hours to get here when it normally takes two hours. So we will see. Um, but yeah, that's all the vlog. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And see you next time. Bye. Bye, guys.